Hi guys, Exeter Rider, thanks for joining me. Um, this is a, uh, it's a bit of a deflated post actually. This is about the camera that I just brought, which is the DJI Osmo action camera and what it's like for motor vlogging. Uh, I highly advise you don't buy this camera if you're going to use it for motor vlogging. And here's the reason why. Okay, so the reason I bought the DJI is because I bought DJI products before and they've always been really, really good. Um, but in this case, uh, it's, this has been a total letdown. Okay, so for the last year, I've been using the Drift Ghost X camera, which has been really good, um, pretty much faultless really. However, the picture quality has never been up to speed. So I wanted to start shooting in 4K, 60 frames per second. And so I bought this camera. Um, I looked into the, uh, the GoPros and there's a few things I didn't like about them, uh, one of them being battery life, overheating, and things like that. So I wanted to give DJI a go again because they have always been quite reliable and always re a really good product in my opinion. Um, I've got the gimbal, for example, and that's, that's really good. Um, so I thought I couldn't go wrong. And uh, sure enough, I, I got the, uh, uh, when I first tried it, it was really, really good. It, the picture quality, the, the menus were easy to use. Everything about it was fantastic. But I just had to wait for this little thing here, which is the mic adapter. So the most important thing about running a YouTube channel, of course, is picture quality and audio. All right, if you haven't got any of those fundamentals and, and you've had it, you're not even going to get off the starting block. And uh, so picture quality was fantastic. I was so pleased with it. But when I plugged this little one in, this is £40, by the way. It's, you know, really £40. Um, I mean, that's, that's a Mickey take. Why they can't build these things in, I don't know. Um, but yeah, so I, I got bought this and uh, stuck it inside, tried the mic and the sound was awful. Okay, it was just, it was just terrible. So I spent four days now, three, three or four days on and off, um, away from my family, you know, doing things I want to do. And uh, I've, I've got a lone bike at the moment, which I want to use and, and to film. And uh, I haven't been able to do that because I've been trying to sort the audio out. I thought it might have been my helmet. I tried different mics. I've got three different mics and none of them work, right? So I went onto the forums and uh, noticed that there were some other people that had the same issue. The annoying thing is, is that no one has been able to sort this issue out, which is, which is the most frustrating thing. DJI come up with an update. I updated it. I put the mic in different places. List goes on. Uh, I've put dead cats on, dead cats off. It, it doesn't work, all right? It's, it's not up to standard. So if you're looking at buying a DJI Osmo action camera for moto vlogging with an external mic set up within the helmet, honestly don't. Don't waste your money. Uh, I've, I and many other people have wasted my money on it and this camera is going back to Amazon now. Okay, it's, it's, it is rubbish, right? The, everything about it is perfect, but the audio on it is not even close to acceptable standard. So don't waste your money like I did. Don't waste your time, all right? That's the most precious thing of all, isn't it? It's time. Don't waste your time buying it, getting it, trying to set it up. Because in my opinion, and many others, um, it just isn't gonna happen. So go down the route of GoPro. Um, I'm not out to slate DJI as a company because they are a good company. But I've lost four days of my life trying to get this right. And this should have been sorted before it even was launched. Uh, they, they must know about it. They obviously obviously know about it now, but they must have known about it before it was even launched. And launching a, you know, a perfect camera, which effectively has no audio, is not acceptable. And uh, it's wasted my time. And I, I take that quite personally. So I'm not going to have that. Um, Right, so yeah, back to Amazon. I don't know what I'm gonna do now. Uh, I think I'll probably go down the GoPro route. Um, but that is more pricey. GoPro is, uh, I'm filming this in September and uh, I think the GoPro 9 is coming out in October. Um, however, I think, I think I'll probably get, might go for the GoPro 8. 
Um, as I say, I've got uh, getting loan bikes at the moment, and last thing I want is to film um, bad quality audio uh, or pictures. You know, for, for for their sake, you know, they they're lending me the bikes. The least I can do is get things right on the picture and audio side of things. So. Um, thumbs down DJI really really hacked off with this one it's, uh, it's been a real letdown. Um, please just don't bother bringing out anything in the future unless you beta test it you know and the audio and things like that um, it's, it's just you're just going to wreck yourself if, if, you, if you do these things anyway there you go that's my opinion um, I just want to help everyone else you know other people before they have to go through what I've been through in the last three days. All right. Okay. Thanks for watching. And uh, I hope it's been useful. Um, and I will see you in the next video. If you haven't liked and subscribed, uh, if this is the first time to the channel, <laughs> then it's probably not, probably not the best video. Um, but I do a lot of reviews and anything motorbike really is, is my thing. So, um, don't take this as a benchmark. This is the, the first thumbs down video ever. So, uh, but do thumbs up it if you would. It'd be much appreciated. All right, see you on the next video. Cheerio. Well, quite stocky. So, uh, 62. And that's what I would expect from a 125. I would expect a huge amount more. That's, that's pretty much all you need, really. It doesn't give you that rider sort of feel to it, so. And I don't know, I apologise if the audio is crap as well. I've had a right old full lake with that as well. well. Um, so just let me know if you like the side view or the front view, okay? That would be very interesting for me to know. It's, uh, the actual audio on it is horrendous, right? And yes, you can put in the different factors of the different dead cats or mics or the position of the mic, um, list goes on and on and on and on. Uh, but the fact is, is that this camera is not up for doing any external audio. It will not be able to hack it. So don't even bother trying it and, and wasting your money. Um, everybody is in the same boat with this, uh, with this camera. There's only one person I know who's made it work and that's uh, Moto UK. Um, but apart from that, apart from him should I say, no one else can make this stupid camera work, or the audio. And it's such a loss because DJI were really on to something with this, they got everything perfectly right. And I honestly do mean perfect. But if you can't have an external mo uh, mic on a... On a uh, on an action camera that works for motor vloggers then you're on an absolute dead start aren't you so my disappointment in the DJI you know it is just massive I just totally pissed off of them and uh, it's a shame because all their other products seem pretty good and uh, you know I've got a DJI gimbal and that's really good but they've totally let the side down on this one yeah, so I'm pretty pissed off, as you can tell. Um, I wasn't going to film it, but I thought, you know what, let's get the camera out and start filming. But don't buy this camera if you're going to use it with an external microphone and the uh, with a mic adapter. And uh, updates or not, it's not going to work and you won't be able to make it work. totally pissed off four days I've been trying to get this right now and I should be reviewing this bike and other things anyway there you go it's up to you now but my, I strongly advise you not to waste your time and uh, just stick with a GoPro GoPro products aren't perfect but at least the audio works all right back to the office